In this problem, we're told a net force of 265 newtons accelerates a bike and rider at 2.3 meters per second squared. And they're asking us to find the mass of the bike and the rider together. So let's go ahead and write down what's given. So given, and so we're told that a net force of 265 newtons, so our force, which we represent that by F, equals 265 newtons. And then we're also told uh, the bike and rider uh, go at, or their acceleration is 2.3 meters per second squared. So A equals 2.3 meters per second squared. And they tell us to find the mass of the bike and rider together. So we represent mass by M. So I'm going to write M equals question mark because that's what we're trying to find. And so uh, the equation that you want to uh, use to solve this is force equals mass times acceleration. So we're trying to find mass. So we're going to have to manipulate this equation uh, in order to solve for mass. So if we want to manipulate this and solve for mass, all we have to do is divide both sides by A, and we'll get that M equals F over A. So basically, mass equals force uh, divided by acceleration. And so when you solve this, you have to make sure that your force is in newtons and your acceleration is measured in meters per second squared, as long as you're using uh, standard units or uh, the metric system. So. Uh, what we do want to do is make sure that our units are correct. And in this case, it's newtons, and this is meters per second squared, so we're fine. So all we got to do is just plug them in. So force is 265 over our acceleration, which is 2.3. And so if you go ahead and do this, uh, 265 divided by 2.3, you're going to get that M equals 115. And so when we have newtons and meters per second squared, uh, you're going to get that the mass is measured in kg. So it's going to be 115 kg. And so that's going to be your answer. So the mass of the bike and rider together are 115 uh, kilograms.